Hey guys, welcome back to Strawberry Vanilla. Wee, what's that? I'm doing my line. I know, but mine's up there. We're trying to introduce. They know what it is. It's Smooth Brian. I'm Smooth Mia. Smooth Brian. I'm Emily. Emily. Go read your line. This is okay, 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 okay. So last time, last we left off, they were in the bedroom. That's not where we left off. Yes, last. they're in the fucking bedroom. No, la last we left off. Um, the steaming girl came into, um, our house was eating our cookies and then she and then they went to their bedroom. It's what, time there to was sleep. more. Well, they probably watched it or they're very familiar with this game. I'm sure she told us we were going to, she told us she was going to reap our soul. And, and then, um, basically our parents Ugh. came in and now she's uh, staying with us under the guise of oh a, a, a Slavic foreign exchange student, but she's actually a demon. She wants to reap our soul. Hey, what's that? What did I do? You went back. Press X. <laughs> Take it. Ray, what's that? <laughs> That's my stuffed alpaca. Alpaca? His name is Gil. I know stuffed animals are a little childish, but I can't get rid of them. You have a lot of stuffed animals. Do you want to talk about that? I think I have like four here. Here? Yeah. Do you have more at home? Maybe. Do you want to talk about that? No, I don't, actually. You don't have anything to say about that? No, I don't. I because statistically, fine. people who sleep with a lot of stuffed animals I don't are sleep with more them. lonely. I don't sleep with them. I think it's, it They're counts if my you shelf. own them. The why, are they on their, why are they on your shelf? It's a display thing. Like collectors. Like items. an exhibitionist thing? Are you into that? No. There were some of my best and only friends a few years ago. And yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> it checks out. And throwing them out would be too sad. That feels more like you. Ah, see, noses. That's my other stuff to help back. <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> yes, it is. She has two. They're friends. Say his name. His name is Kyoto. Koto. Kote yo. Kote I can't read Kodo. English. Kodo. That's it. We got from Kyoto. Payphone. They still have payphones. That's Phoebe. Bridgers. Oh, I don't listen to that. Are you gay? Are you gay? Maybe. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> I'm gay. <laughs> I'm going to call him Kyoto. Um, I see Kyoto and Gil. <laughs> Gil looks kind of grumpy, don't you think? Tag yourself. No. <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, go tag yourself. Tag yourself. I'm Kodo. You're Gil. No, Gil is the one who's smiling. Kyoto is a grumpy one, and you'd be grumpy too if you <laughs> if you'd killed your own father. Whoa. He <laughs> killed his own father. Oh, I just realized her outfit. Um. Rai's outfit is like a little ice cream cone. Yeah, like the skirts, the cone. Yeah. It's really cute. Yeah. I feel like we did, I feel like, are these her pajamas? I feel like I didn't notice this before. I this guess is they, an outfit change. Yeah, I guess this is, this is her pajamas. I mean, I wouldn't sleep with a butterfly clip in my hair, but that's just me. I would, I've done that before. Yeah, you've done a lot of things before. Because you're dirty. Do you feel good about that? No, I <laughs> regretted it as soon as I said it. That's right. It's a long story. I spent a lot of time playing with those alpacas, so they have long, sprawling backstories that couldn't be explained. Do yours? Do yours? Some of them do. Which ones? Do I have to talk yes. about this? Which ones? Well, Lammy is uh, not oh. here. Well, Lammy was my childhood one. He's, okay. a, he's a lamb. Okay. It's very sweet. Really creative name, by the way. Well, he was orphaned. Okay. And when he came to me, he told me his name was Lammy. He talked to you? Yeah. Did you tell your therapist about that? No, I didn't. Maybe you should. Well, maybe you should get a therapist. I'm working on it. Read your fucking lines. You interrupted Read me. Read your lines! So they have long, sprawling backstories that couldn't be explained without a full-length visual no a narrative. Two animated spin-offs, several movies, and a slew of manga and light novels. <laughs> this is a really good story, actually. And what's that, We A clock? A cock? Is that a cock? <laughs> That's right, it's dead though. I need to buy some new batteries. And I don't plan on doing that anytime soon. <laughs> yeah, girl, time is an illusion. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Yes, queen, go off. It's a construct, baby. <laughs> <laughs> the clock was a present from dad, but it ticks way too loudly. It's impossible to get sleep with that thing turned on. <laughs> I know what about all these books here. The 
ones on the top shelf are my English textbooks. The bottom ones are novels. Mm. Leachia picks up one of my books without asking. <laughs> okay. Someone's like a little like, what's the word? What what word? Like, what? um, not angsty, but like when angsty? you're being like backhanded. You know what I mean? Passive aggressive? Yes. Really? Someone's being a little bad. <laughs> Leachia picks up one of my books without asking and begins to flip through it. Whore. <laughs> what a bitch. I think about scolding her. The dirty little slut. But I'm barely able to open my mouth when she shoves, shoves her, her whole titty. fucking hand down my throat. <laughs> and I <laughs> like it. <laughs> How can you read all of this? Your pussy must be so smart. <laughs> your brain must be just as big as your fucking pussy. <laughs> Uh, pussy joke. The writing is so tiny. There aren't even any pictures. <laughs> so she's dumb. Please. <laughs> I'm nine years old. No. Oh, I don't need pictures to keep my mind. That sec my mind engaged. Cause oh, I'm nine. No, this is weird. But it looks so dull. I'm getting tired just skimming through it. <gasps> Big yawn. Yeah. It's pretty in character too. Yeah. She's tired. And then put it back. Oh my God. <laughs> I didn't say you could rifle through my things, did I, mm. bitch? <laughs> I suppose not. <laughs> Lichia giggles and slaps, <laughs> and slaps my throat and slaps my book back onto the shelf. Ir <laughs> Irritatingly, does everyone enjoy listening to this beautiful soundscape? <laughs> Irritatingly, she doesn't put it back in the correct Place. Oh, that's, that's like such a, a Virgo, Virgo thing. thing. Yeah, not me though. No. I'm going to need to sort that out at some point. Maybe when she goes to have her bath. Do you think that she's going to take a bath? She's a demon. Having Leechy in my room, prodding and poking at every single little thing is an odd experience. I've never had any friends stay over before. Mostly um, because I never had any friends and I'm not used to it. I wish they were at nine. That's a bummer. I know. I don't like it when mom or dad come into my room, let alone a complete stranger. Can we make them 19 just for us to be yeah, safer? Yeah, they're 19. They're 19. <laughs> they're, I'm 19. <clears throat> well, as long as Lichia doesn't search under my bed, it should be, what's under there? It Her should toys. Be... Her sex toys, because she's 19. Yeah, because she's 19. It should be fine. I can cope with at least this many unwanted intrusions. You know, I really, uh, I only really read manga. <laughs> Manga a lot? You do, do you? Yes! I like romance stories, especially ones with lots of roses and smells. Aw, she's so romantic. I didn't realize manga was so popular in hell. Mm. Especially that girly romance manga. <laughs> I don't even read those kinds of stories. Do you? I did. Did you? Yeah, I did. I Are there other kind of manga? Yeah, like action show, show, shoujin, like fighting. And there's like dark, like mysterious, like. Is there porn? Yeah, there is. I knew manga has been getting more and more popular lately, but I didn't realize the market was that lucrative. <laughs> well, uh, I don't know if it's popular in hell in general. Oh, she's different. Yeah. But mom likes those kinds of. <sighs> Yeah, take a moment, <sighs> breathe it in. I'm just getting sleepy. Yeah. <laughs> Mom makes this kind of stories. Uh, we have a huge bookcase at home filled with volumes of. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? I don't know. What does that say? Silky mommy. Mammy? M mommy? Mommy? Miami? Mommy. Mammy and Violet. Ma Silky Miami. Silky Miami and uh, Violet of the Versace. That's French. Versace. <laughs> Versace. I know French. French. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Your mother likes that kind of thing? They're gonna bond. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna bond over their mommy issues. I can't wait. Just like us. Just like us. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> she loves Japanese culture. We even have a pencil tree in our garden. I don't know if that means a pause. It keeps dying though, since uh, the air now is filled with <laughs> sulfur. 
Does your mother also wear kimonos around the house and put chopsticks in her hair? It's going to become a commentary on, like, cultural appropriation. She isn't really a kimono kind of person. Good. At least that's something. Yeah. Yeah, we avoided that commentary. Yeah. She prefers to dress up as cute characters. Oh, no. I'm really <laughs> digging myself into a deep hole here every time. Are cute characters from anime and manga? Oh, no. It's even worse than I thought. It's even worse than we thought. Yeah. Japanophilia is a scary thing. It wow. Just, isn't that just called, like... Oh, I don't know. I'm glad that we're talking about this, but I, I don't like that we're not addra- addressing the pedophilia that is yeah. intended in this game. Yeah. But I'm glad we're talking about the cultural appropriation. Yeah, we'll draw a line there. It hasn't just reached the Western world. It's also managed to pollute hell itself. And that's something. Why must I, a cute and innocent girl of only 19, 19 years, live in such a corrupt world? So is that why you can speak Japanese? That's right! Mom insisted. She said that all of her daughters had to learn the language. I grew up watching anime and uh, reading manga. I suppose that answers one question, then. <laughs> yeah, and I was beginning to wonder whether conveniently Japanese was... I don't know. Japanese was the most common language amongst the uh, denizens of hell. Oh, like c- citizens, but they're demons. I feel like demons can probably speak all languages. I, fe- I think so, too. I don't know why they have to learn it. I feel like they should just know Like, it. what did she think the default was? Yeah, probably, like... French. To go to hell? Yeah. In hell? Like, there's probably mostly French people. Why would like you say Timothy that? Like, Timothy Chalamet's going <laughs> to hell. <laughs> Timothy Chalamet, well... Yeah, maybe... He is. Yeah. yeah At least right. French Americans. Yeah. That's who hell mm-hmm. is for. Timothy Chalamet, Lily Rose Depp. Who's that bitch you hate? But you watch her YouTube videos. Camille, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 her, her. <laughs> well, there's a reason. Do you want to talk about it? No. <sighs> Press the button. Now I know Lichia, and by her extent, her family, must be a special case. Oh, you didn't think that before? What language do you... Oh, we're about to find out. What language do you usually speak in hell, then? In... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> English, of course. I spit on French. And some French because of <laughs> everyone in hell is French American, so they speak English and French. <laughs> of course they do. Yeah. I hate Timothy. <laughs> if you're in the business of ferrying souls, if you're in the business of ferrying souls, it makes sense that you'd speak one of the most common languages on earth. Oh my god, I have to tell you about this TikTok guy I saw today, right? Though, so because ferrying. So in <laughs> no, listen. So this. So in Harry Potter. Oh my god. There's this moment in the fifth novel, mm-hmm. which is the longest. That has nothing to do with it. Okay. I'm just flexing. Okay. Um, but because it's your favorite. It is my favorite. I know. Anyway, so there's this there's this part where the twins um there's an peeves there's a huge like a swamp they install on like one of the in one of the corridors so you can't cross it Mm -hmm. because it's a swamp. Mm -hmm. But in English, do you know what punting is? You know what it means to punt. Um, what does it mean in America? Punting. I don't know. You You know what it means. No, I don't. You don't know what punting is? Well, now I see American football. Oh no, I don't. Oh my god, so it's like kicking, like when you punt, like a field goal. Are you serious? Yes. You don't know this? No. Because football. Anyway, you I'm kick sorry. it. You kick it. You, you kick, look at kick me it. and you think that I watch football? You kick it. Okay. You kick it. I watch football because I want the male you attention. You kick it. Okay. That's sad, by the way. And you should unpack that. Mm-hmm. Are you unpacking that in therapy? I will. Stop bringing up my therapist. Why don't you talk about Harry Potter a bit more? Okay, so, you, so they say that... Um, Filch has to, like, he took on the task of punting the children across the swamp. But in... in he kicks, though? It's a, it's a boat in English. In, in oh. England, it's like, like a ferry. Like, you ferry them across. Interesting. So I thought, and this, this woman on TikTok also who made a TikTok about it, mm-hmm. she was like, I thought that he kicked them. But it's really a boat. Thank you so much for taking the time to explain that for me. I mean, oh, the woman on TikTok did it in less time and more concisely. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking sure she did. Anyway, don't you think you should be going to a uh, 4 a.m. Uh, bath now? It's getting late. And I want to put my bookshelf back in order, bitch. I know that book still isn't in the right place, bitch. And it's bothering me. 
bitch. See, here's the thing about Virgos that mm-hmm. I understand why they're doing that to her. But I'm going to take your Capricorn rising and I'm really going to run with it. Yeah, go ahead. And I really just, I really think that's more of a Capricorn thing. Or like, mm-hmm. a di- I don't think that's inherently a Virgo thing. It's not. And I really think a Virgo would just switch it. It's It would true. be like, it just doesn't go there. Yeah. You know? Because they're more, because the thing about Virgos, right, it's a mutable sign. They're more like, they're more go with the flow than a Capricorn who is like a cardinal sign. So it's like, they start things. So like, they would start. They would never, like, I would never wait for someone to leave to not switch, like, to make them not feel bad. Like, no. I'd be like, I just want you to know. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Yeah, no. I really do think, yeah, that's just a big misconception of Virgos in general, that they I think just that feel they're like, very organized like that. And people, like, just put, like, books in their hands. Like, yeah. like it's just a thing. Which, I mean, I, like, I read. But, yeah. like, I do feel like Capricorns probably read more, and nobody really talks about that. Yeah, they that. probably read more mo- nonfiction. That's so embarrassing. Uh, yeah. Sure, I'm used to washing and so uh, So, having a bath in a human house sounds like fun. Far be it for me to judge. <laughs> now she's deciding not to judge. She's like, that's actually not my thing. I'm <laughs> no. actually a really open-minded person. That's such a Virgo thing to say. <laughs> but bathing in sulfurous water doesn't sound appealing at all. In fact, it sounds downright dangerous. There was like, there's a lot of sulfur. It smells like sulfur. Have you ever had well water? From what well? From a well. No, I haven't. Well, in 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 rural Pennsylvania, where some of my family is from, yeah, like the water smells like eggs because they're sulfur, but it's not enough to hurt you. Yeah. So you can drink it. It just smells like shit. Yeah, I've smelled sulfur before. I'm just saying it's in the water. Uh, yeah, I know. Well, I'm not judging. I don't know why why you're being so aggressive I'm about that. I'm not being I aggressive. Know. Are you going to come too? Wait. Oh my god. What the hell is happening? <laughs> what the hell? I <laughs> will when you're <laughs> you've finished up. Yeah. Cuz I'm 19. <laughs> but I thought uh Japanese people <sighs> What? I thought all Japanese people pit together. Is that a thing? It's what my mother said. <laughs> and you, you believe wa- everything your mother you said? You wash yourself in hot springs, right? What uh, the hell? So like the ones in hell with uh, less brimstone. People might bathe together in hot springs, but <laughs> there isn't a hot spring in my house. We just have a plain, ordinary bathtub that I, I would... <clears throat> I, I would get in with you if you wanted <laughs> to. Because I'm 19, and I think you're really cute. <laughs> but it's uh, big enough to share, right? Like, if you wanted to, uh, we could do it together. I think we were really smart about the voices in this, and that I play the mom and the dad. And I play <laughs> Ryan and Leach. You. <laughs> you just sit there quietly. <laughs> and then it's just one person going back and forth for a really long time. I mean, it really does hurt. I'm sorry, you chose that fucking voice for me. It hurt before. I started using that voice. I think it hurt from um, Cyberpunk. Maybe you should have warmed up. I think I was so bored. Aren't you an actor? That it's set into my vocal cords. Shouldn't you warm up? Are you hearing me? Are you listening to me? Not really, because I don't want to. It's boring and dumb. (laughs) Boring and dumb. Even if it is big enough to share, I I don't want to. Is she like (laughs) humble bragging about her big bath? I don't want to. I don't want to share my huge bathtub with you. <laughs> with you poor, poor... Sorry to break it to you. Little poor bitch. Um, but I don't feel comfortable oh. having a bath with um, a complete stranger. Huh? Are you sure about that? Please? Please <laughs> get in the bathtub with me. I'm also 19. I'm a consenting age. I just... If we see nine-year-old, like, anime porn, oh, I'm going to be so pissed. No, I don't... Because they wouldn't do that. I hope right? not. Right? They talked about cultural like I ge- Oh, no. Yeah, I'm very sure. I, I don't really... Am I stupid or I just don't understand what the second one means? And there are no two ways about it. I think she's just saying the same thing. Yeah. I'm, I'm making it difficult. Let's just go... Let's be I'm simple. I'm very sure. Yeah. I'm sure. I, <laughs> I don't need um, to think about it. I'm not <laughs> going to bathe with you naked. Why is Lichia being so insistent anyway? I hardly even know her. Is this really gonna be porn? I really- I have no idea. I'm really scared. Clingy people are so annoying. Damn, tell that me. That line didn't have to be in there yeah, for either no. of us. That was mean. Yeah. But I'm not used to bathing by myself. I always do it with my sisters. Uh-huh. Huh? I'll be lonely in the top on my own. Top! <laughs> <clears throat> You'll have to make do as best you can, because I'm definitely not going to get naked with you. 
and help you wash your soapy body. Oh. Yes. Well, it uh, probably wouldn't be that nice bathing with you anyway. What the hell? What is happening? What? Oh my god. I, what, what do you mean by that? What the heck? Uh, my sisters are nice and kind to me, but you have been a huge meanie. <laughs> I bet you wouldn't even care if I got shampoo in my eyes. Oh my god. That That's right. I wouldn't. I, I'd i laugh at you for being stupid enough to get shampoo in your eyes I'm in the first place. so confused. <gasps> Oh my god, if you want somebody to dote and call you like a baby, why don't you pester my... Oh my god! Why don't you pester my mom instead? That's so mean. <gasps> Speak of the devil. Oh my, did somebody call me? M mom, what are, you, what are you doing here? I was just passing by. But, but, it's like, you appeared out of nowhere. Do you think she's a demon? Does my mother know magic? <gasps> if that weren't so ridiculous, I'd almost be tempted to believe it. Isn't it about time that the two of you had a bath? Mom. What the fuck? It's getting late. I want to have a bath, but uh, why is being mean? She won't bathe with me, <coughs> even though I asked nicely. I don't like bathing on my own. My, my. That truly is terrible. How could you be so cold, Rye? What the fuck? I'm not being cold. I have a right to Oh What's God. happening? Uh, well, it's a good thing <gasps> I'm not selfish. Unlike you. Would you like to share a uh, Oh, uh. Would, uh, you, uh, <laughs> would you like to share a bath with me, Legia? I'm. <gasps> oh, my God. I'm good at washing hair since I have so much of it. I'll be very oh. gentle. Oh, my God. And I won't get shampoo in your eyes. Huh? You promise? Oh the my god. Fuck? I don't know. What the fuck? I promise. Oh my god. I never want to make a sweet young girl like you cry. A sweet young girl who's fully aged 19 <laughs> years old. Who's legal and able to consent? I'd never want to make a young woman like you, a young adult, cry. No. I'll be very, very careful. Yay! Thank you! Oh, miss, what's your name? Y Yukini? Yukini! It's not a problem at all, sweetheart. <laughs> I don't know. Ugh. Why does mom have to bow to Lichia's, Lichia's wishes anyway? Oh, we're confused about this whole thing. I can't remember the last time she bathed with me. I mean, th right? Because you're 19, so that'd be weird. Yeah. <laughs> not that Nickelodeon. <laughs> not I'm more than capable of looking after myself. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Should we... Before we unpack what's happening on the screen there. I guess we're not going to see the bath. I'm good with ending here. All right. I thought we were going to see some hot 19-year-old on MILF action, <laughs> no. but I guess it would be pretty bad since she's canonically nine. Canonically nine. Well, um, thank you guys so much for joining. Um, this is episode three of Strawberry Vinegar. If you want to see more. I don't. I don't, but if you guys really want it. If you want it. Let us know. And if anything else that you guys want to see, let us know. Because hopefully it has less canonically nine-year-olds. Nine-year-olds, like, yeah. In sexual If you have any video game wrecks that don't have nine-year-olds in it. Leave them in the comments. Yeah, how about Emily? Why don't you ask for some more specific recommendations for types of sh stuff that you like? Yeah, I'd like stuff um, that doesn't have nine years old, nine year olds in it. Um, I would like to play a game. Mm -hmm. I'd like to play a game. I'd like to win. Mm -hmm. I like when there's smaller games inside of a big game. So many games. And um, I yeah, I mean my my selling point would be no nine year olds. Yeah, and I'll stick with that. Cool. Well, you guys heard the you guys heard the lady. Uh, thank you guys so much. Subscribe, follow, whatever. Like, it's whatever. Like, click, share, comment. Like, click, share, comment. Okay. Bye. Bye.